Selena Gomez says she's accepting life in her 30s, she care less, so it's really nice. Selena Gomez hosted her Rare Impact Fund benefit at Naya Studios in Hollywood on Wednesday. Hello viewers, welcome to Leo Entertains. Please don't forget to subscribe and hit the notification bell to stay updated on your favorite celebrities. Selena Gomez is approaching her 30s. The Who Says Singer, 31, hosted her Rare Impact Fund benefit at Naya Studios in Hollywood on Wednesday and revealed exclusively to people that she no longer feels pressure to reach certain milestones or benchmarks in her third decade. Now that I'm 30, I care less, so it's actually nice, she tells people. I should focus on the things that actually matter to me and not worry about the things that were holding me back. The Rare Beauty Foundation, which hosted a benefit on Wednesday to raise money for youth mental health, also opened up to people about its hopes the benefit will leave a lasting impact. When asked if she wanted the Rare Antique Fund to be her legacy, Gomez said, I really hope so. I'm kind of nervous. It's the first time I've ever thrown something away, and I hate asking people for money, so I don't know, she adds. It's a strange concept but I know we're doing something good and I couldn't be luckier to have the platform to do it. Before benefiting from the Rare Impact Fund, Gomez revealed on Instagram that in honor of World Mental Health Day on October 10th, Sephora will donate all Rare Beauty Fund sales to the Rare Impact Fund for 24 hours. In her speech at Wednesday's event, Gomez became emotional as she talked about her mental health journey and how her sister Gracie, 10, was inspired to create the fund. I struggled with the world inside my head for a long time and felt lost and felt hopeless at times, she said in her speech. In 2020, I received my diagnosis of bipolar disorder. To be honest, everything changed quickly. Gomez went on to reveal that after her diagnosis, she was able to get the answers and knowledge she needed. The actress added that she hopes her sister's generation will have a kinder and more meaningful future with the mental health support they need. I know we all have a Gracie in our lives who makes us want to be better and do better, who can motivate us, connect us, and make a difference, Gomez concluded. 